To prescribe warfarin, search for it in protocols. There are two options to choose from. Warfarin for inpatients defaults the prescription to 1400. This is so that nurses have sufficient time in hours to remind prescribers to prescribe continuation doses. If you are prescribing after 1400, then you will also need to prescribe the warfarin for inpatients stat. Otherwise, no dose will be available to be given until the following day of 1400. Order entry will open with a regular order automatically selected. Here you can enter irregular doses for up to seven days. Zero milligrams can be prescribed. If you need to enter less doses, you can leave the later entries blank. If a regular order is required, then select this option from the drop down menu. Now you can enter the regular dose. It is advised not to use days or doses of treatment, as the prescription will stop with no prompt for the nurses to get it re-prescribed. For irregular doses, the review date will be the day after the last dose. When the review date is reached, the warfarin cannot be administered by the nurse until it is modified by the doctor and future doses are prescribed. You can also see that more doses are due on the inpatient prescribing screen as question marks are visible for future administrations on the order. The nurse will see the following in administration. If it is clicked on by the nurse, instead of being able to chart it, a message will appear telling them to contact the prescriber. INR targets are optional but encouraged. You could also enter INR results. Review the order and confirm to prescribe. To modify the order, click on the drug and then the Order Modify tab. Select a reason and then prescribe more doses. It is also possible to enter further INR results and view historic ones in a chart. Press confirm to prescribe. Warfarin coming up for review also appears on Doctor's Friend.